chronic neutrophilic leukemia or CNL is a pretty rare myeloproliferative neoplasm. So when we think of MPNs, we more commonly think of ET, PV, or myelofibrosis, but there are a couple of other rare subsets and CNL is one of those. Um, CNL is often driven by slightly different mutations as opposed to PV, ET, or myelofibrosis. One common genetic mutation to see in CNL is uh, involving a gene called CSF3R. The actual symptoms of CNL are uh, often similar to what's seen in other MPNs. We often see constitutional symptoms like fatigue, fevers, chills, night sweats, those sorts of things. We often see splenomegaly as well. The blood count profile looks a little different in CNL. Um, what we typically see is relatively high white blood cell counts made up mainly of mature neutrophils in that white blood cell differential. The treatments of CNL um, are somewhat similar to other MPNs, but maybe a little bit different depending on the specific genetic mutation that's identified for the individual patient.